Hi guys, today I want to show you how to insert interactive elements to our simple house model, for example doors, and how to make uh, doors to interact with uh, the basic uh, first person and the third person asset packages. First we insert the door, the door is inside tiles uh, folder, it is a prefab, a pre-made prefab, um, it is composed by two animators uh, for uh, animating uh, the door for open and close animation and uh, a rigid body for uh, the door panel and even to switch that uh, check for uh, an action event and when it receives the action event it sends open uh, event if it is opening to the animator that uh, contains the open uh, animation in the case it is closing it sends a close event to the animator that has the close animation so if i send a action event to the event switch it send the open event to the opening animator and then the door opens if i send again action event the switch closes and then send the close event to the closing animator this is the door now we have to insert a player for interacting with the door first we try with the first person player take in mind that in this new version all the players third person and first person have the possibility to send an action event when the action button is pressed now we insert into the project first the uh, first person basic package okay now we can insert the player the action command is set here action and this is the q k on keyboard and the pad y on the console pad uh, these are the same commands uh, we use uh, for uh, the third person character now we try with the FPS player that is the same but containing uh, weapons owning uh, weapons okay also here we have to click on the action key for opening and closing the door now try with the third person package we load the third person okay of course if you have to make a game uh, you have to choose or uh, third person or first person we insert the third person player We have to insert, okay. Uh, and now the player pressing Q will open and close the door, okay. Okay, guys, uh, I think uh, uh, it's all for now. Thank you for watching and bye.